this is my uh, 400 watt Harbor Freight solar panel setup here. I, I uh, install it on a hinge where I could always lower it. Kind of like the other day when we had a lot of snow, I lowered it down, didn't get any snow on it, put it back up the next day where we still had a, had a charge going in a lot. It actually pumps a lot of juice in there with that sun. Uh, even on a cloudy day, it, it seems to do pretty good. Not the best, but pretty good. Let's go inside and show you what I got set up in there. Okay, we come inside and right through the wall here where the, the panels come in, the wiring, I got, got the kit hooked up, the 400 watts coming in. We're getting some charge. Not too sunny yet today. And then it goes from here and goes down to my inverter. Also have the big, big inverter. Uh, was it 5,000 watt, 10,000 watt peak uh, Harbor Freight? Of course, I've got this hooked up to run my TV, my VCR, uh, DVD. Everything turns on, all my lights run off of my switch here. So I have everything with my lamp, lights in the back, lights up here. I've even converted this as well. Seems to do really, really good as long as we got, of course, the, you know, the sunlight. Uh, see, it goes down to three batteries. I have three 12 volt marine batteries and uh, they were probably hundred bucks a piece. And with this whole setup, uh, you know, I can run, you know, my vacuum sweeper off my inverter, my coffee maker. I've had it hooked up to my washing machine before. I've had it hooked up to the, uh, the furnace fan. So when my air conditioner kicks on, the furnace kicks on off of solar. So I've, I've tested and used a lot of different things off this. Uh, and it seems to do really, really well. Of course, you got to manage your batteries and then, you know, make sure you got enough power for, for at night time. So you don't have anything kicking off, but I use four aught. You can't, can't see that in there. They recommend three aught gauge or four aught. I had to get the biggest one, but it goes directly under the house here and plugs into the inverter and of course goes up so hope this helps you uh thanks for watching